The initiated Measure 26 Task Force met this morning to discuss rules and regulations regarding medical marijuana in South Dakota. Kelloland Sophie Heineman has the story. Where a dispensary can be, how many can be there, and how to regulate licensing were some of the topics discussed by the IM26 Task Force for Medical Marijuana, all of which will impact the community and potential small business owners of dispensaries. Well, some of the big takeaways would be capping licensing. Um, there's uh, inadvertent effects of capping licensing, and when you do that or having high cut licensing fees, you end up selling to big cannabis. I don't think that holds out to South Dakota values to selling out to big industries. South Dakota native Kittrick Jeffries is an advocate for medical marijuana with Dakota Cannabis Consulting. He's been lobbying across the state for the past several weeks, sharing statistics on what other states have seen work and fail, including whether to deem marijuana an agricultural product like hemp. Our marijuana and hemp it all comes from the same family of cannabis. The only difference is an arbitrary number of 0.3% THC. So to Consider cannabis not an agricultural product, I think is a, just a misstatement. It needs to be considered ag. While much is still unclear on what medical marijuana in South Dakota will look like, what is clear is that rolling out rules and regulations will be met with a conservative and cautious approach. I think the biggest thing is that you're going to see things go really slow because businesses are going to take a while to open up no matter where they're located because they're not going to be able to even get a license until October 1st. October 4th is when the task force is preparing to have more solid rules and regulations regulations laid out. Well, the state needs to uh, promulgate their rules, which will dictate how businesses will run and businesses can't get a license until that happens. So uh, on a local level, we need to pass ordinances that would regulate how the businesses are going to operate, where they can be, smoking regulations, potentially odor regulations, everything related to marijuana. In Sioux Falls, Sophie Heineman, Kelly Lynn News. The next meeting is set for July 21st at 8.30 a.m.